what if an interstellar object whirling through our solar system is actually a nuclear-powered spacecraft sent by aliens to test how humans respond? That's what a noted astrophysicist believes might be the case. And he says an image from the Hubble telescope backs him up. Something is streaking through our solar system that has astronomers on edge and policymakers on alert. The newly discovered 3i Atlas isn't just another passing comet, it's the largest, brightest interstellar visitor ever recorded, arriving with a composition and trajectory that challenge nearly every known scientific model. Its bizarre properties, an 8 to 1 carbon dioxide to water ratio, a mysterious green glow, and course corrections, eerily precise as it approaches Mars, have sparked legitimate fears and explosive debates. Interstellar Intruder – The Discovery That Shocked the World 3i Atlas was discovered on July 1st by the NASA-funded Atlas Survey. Uh, it was discovered using their uh, telescope at Rio Hurtado in Chile, and it was first detected as a speck of light moving relative to background stars. We collected a good amount of data, more than 100 observations. We know its trajectory fairly well. We know it came from outside the solar system. Right now it's inside uh, the orbit of Jupiter, and it's headed for its closest pass to the Sun at the end of October. July 1st, 2025 marked a watershed moment for astronomy. The Atlas Survey Telescope in Chile detected a faint object with an unbound hyperbolic orbit, evidence that it was not native to our solar system. This alone made 3i Atlas historic. Only two other interstellar objects had ever been observed, Oumuamua and Borisov. The designation 3i, third interstellar, reflects its rarity, while Atlas credits the survey system that found it. But the excitement quickly gave way to anxiety. Initial data revealed the object was enormous, at least 5.6 kilometers across, possibly much larger, and racing towards the sun at velocities up to 209,000 kilometers per hour, far faster than typical solar system comets. Its trajectory was more than just a casual flyby. Calculations showed it would pass closely by Venus, Jupiter, Mars, and eventually reach its closest point to Earth in December 2025, even as it remained over 1.8 AU from our planet. What set 3i Atlas apart wasn't only its speed or scale. Within days of discovery, astronomers realized it wasn't acting like any comet they'd seen. Its detection, as far out as June, signaled prolonged activity, later confirmed by observations from NASA's Transiting Exoplanet Survey Satellite, TESS. The object had already sported a coma and tail at distances where few comets become active, a sign that something extraordinary was happening. The world's most powerful telescopes, including Hubble, JWST, and the VLT, pivoted to study this visitor. Every new observation deepened its mystery, transforming initial excitement into urgent concern. Unprecedented Chemistry For scientists accustomed to traditional comet compositions, 3i Atlas is an unnerving anomaly. Typical comets contain frozen water with smaller amounts of carbon dioxide and other volatiles. When such bodies approach the sun, Water vapor dominates the coma, the surrounding cloud of gas and dust. But 3i Atlas defied this expectation on an epic scale. JWST's infrared spectrometry revealed that the coma's carbon dioxide to water ratio was an unprecedented 8 to 1, 16 times higher than seen in solar system comets at similar distances from the sun. Such values weren't a statistical fluke, they were six standard deviations above normal readings. Analysis also uncovered exotic signatures. Nickel, an element usually associated with asteroids and terrestrial planets, was present in the coma. Cyanide and traces of carbon monoxide and carbonyl sulfide added to the perplexing chemical mix. This eerie cocktail, combined with the object's striking green glow as it neared Mars, led to rampant speculation about its origins and possible threats. What could produce such a high concentration of carbon dioxide? One theory posits that 3i Atlas formed in a protoplanetary disk where CO2 ice dominated or endured radiation levels far greater than those typical in our solar system. Another hypothesis involves a crust rich in exotic ices, shielding water ice deeper within from solar radiation until closer approach. Buried volatiles melting and erupting as the sun's heat penetrates might explain the comet's early awakening, but the sheer magnitude and nature of the gases remains unsettling. Not just astronomers, but planetary scientists and astrobiologists recognize these chemical signatures as alien. 
not in the sense of technology, but as proof that conditions in distant star systems can yield objects fundamentally unlike any in our solar system. The green hue, usually attributed to dicarbon, C2, in classic comets, persisted even as spectroscopic readings failed to confirm this molecule. The color may stem from cyanide, nickel, or other unfamiliar compounds, raising the stakes for what truly defines a comet. The chemical anomalies have fueled speculation far beyond simple curiosity. If 3i Atlas originated in a violently irradiated zone, its makeup could pose unknown threats, shedding material capable of altering the atmospheres of planets it encounters or even ferrying substances alien to the biochemistry of Earth or Mars. A terrifying trajectory. Well, thanks for having me. First, I should say that uh, if the light that we observe from this object is reflection of sunlight, its size needs to be bigger than Manhattan Island, 20 kilometers or so. And uh, there isn't enough rocky material in interstellar space to deliver a rock of that size uh, earlier than 10,000 years from now. While the odd chemistry of 3i Atlas set off scientific alarm bells, its journey through the solar system paralyzed planetary defense offices and orbital analysts. For weeks, astronomers worked to plot its path, watching for possible collisions. Initially, the calculations were reassuring. Though 3i Atlas would pass close to Mars, within 18 to 30 million miles, it posed no immediate threat to any planet, including Earth. ESA and NASA stressed that its hyperbolic orbit was well understood, likely ensuring it would exit the solar system without impact. But leaked data and independent simulations began to suggest disturbing anomalies. Some media sources and whistleblowers claimed that 3i Atlas had performed up to 14 course corrections within a month. These were not random perturbations, but allegedly precise maneuvers that adjusted its trajectory ever closer to Mars. The possibility of a collision, once dismissed as statistically improbable, was suddenly being reassessed with a 70% probability in certain models, calculating alignment with Mars's orbit to within hours and millions of miles. The timing of potential impact coincided with Mars's closest approach to Earth, amplifying consequences should gravitational effects ripple outward. More chilling was the pattern of course corrections that some analysts described as consistent with adaptive intelligence, possibly even suggesting the presence of autonomous navigation or artificial intelligence on board the interstellar object. Adjustments allegedly increased in frequency and precision as 3i Atlas approached Mars. Anomalies correlated with periods when Earth-based telescopes could not observe the object directly, fueling fears of deliberate concealment. NASA and planetary defense officials continued to reassure the public that no credible evidence pointed toward impact or intelligent control. They released data to show that 3i Atlas's course, though unusual, remained natural and gravitationally dictated. Yet the rumors couldn't be entirely stamped out. Harvard scientist Avi Loeb reignited public debate with provocative papers and blog posts arguing that the trajectory, timing, and chemical features could align with a probe or messenger crafted by intelligent extraterrestrial life for reconnaissance or even hostile purpose. The drama surrounding 3i Atlas unfolded as one of the most heated, polarizing debates in scientific history. On one side, planetary scientists raced to collect and analyze data before the comet vanished behind the sun and out of reach. On the other, theorists and public figures speculated about everything from alien technology to artificial intelligence and cosmic dark forest strategies. NASA maintained a firm stance. All credible data indicated that 3i Atlas was a natural interstellar comet, unique in its composition and activity, but fundamentally not a threat. Now it's time to hear from you. What are your thoughts about 3i Atlas? Let us know in the comments section below.